Hey guys, John here from AccessoryGeeks.com. What I'm going to show you today is how to get Google Search onto your Samsung Fascinate from Verizon Wireless. As you all know, um, Bing is the current uh, default search on the Samsung or on the Fascinate. So we're going to go ahead and show you how to get rid of that. Uh, just to give you a heads up, this Samsung is rooted. So we're just going to go from there. And I have a Launcher Pro as well as um, Astro uh, saved on here. So what I'm going to do is, and I'm on Android Central, credit to Android Central for providing the guide. You're going to go here, and there's going to tell you to download the enhanced Google search from the second post in this forum. So we're going to go to that forum. We're going to wait for it to load. And what they're talking about is that post right there from Mr. Whoop. Page. Okay, cancel. Okay. Mr. Corey uh, Streeter. Credit to him as well. So his instructions state to download to SD card and run. So we're just going to go ahead and run it straight from the phone. Oh no. Okay, I'm gonna take this off screen really quick so I can put in my username and password. Sorry about that guys. Okay, sorry, now it's downloading. And it says the enhanced Google search provided to download it. Once it's installed, we're gonna, well, it's on Google search right now. So we're gonna go ahead and install it. And mind you, I just downloaded it straight from the browser. So you can, or side load it via your um, SD card if you choose to. So done. Okay. Let's get over there. Okay, let's go back home. Home. Okay, as you can see, because I am using Launcher Pro, it gives me this option. So um, one of the one of the um, most important steps is you have to use a third-party launcher. I know there's a TouchWiz step uh, available as well, but for this sake, I'm just going to use Launcher Pro. So once on here, you're going to hold widgets. I'm going to go to search. Click there. Let's do Supra. And it looks like Google is our default search. So there you go. Um, to run through the steps really quick, you have to go to Android Central, download that APK file that's in the second post. Once you download it, you're going to install it onto your phone. And depending on what method you use, whether you do it onto your SD card um, or you download it directly from the browser, which I did, you're going to install that onto your phone and then you're going to have to run a third party um, launcher like a Launcher Pro. You're going to add the search widget onto your home screen. And from there, you can set Launcher Pro as your default, but from there you're going to have Google Search as um, your default search engine. I believe this works the same way. Super up. There you go. So, search button works, and the widget works. So, yay, no more Bing. Anyways, 
I'm John from AccessoryGeeks.com. If you guys have any questions, please uh, subscribe to our channel and leave me a couple comments. I've been really good with uh, responding to a couple of your guys' uh, comments. So, like I said, if you have any questions, please feel free to hit me up. If not, this is John from Accessory Geeks letting you know you got it from a geek.